welcome back to my channel. It's your girl and I come back with another video. Yeah, I look so tired because I am. I literally just got up. It is 10.06. We were supposed to do Zumba at 9.45 and I woke up at like 9.30. So that's not enough time for me to get ready at all. But I'm just gonna do a regular simple workout, me and my friend. She's actually already there, so I need to hurry up. Yeah, we're just gonna go through the day every day with me you know just running some errands that i gotta do but make sure you guys like comment and subscribe stay tuned for this video and make sure you guys start your day off with positive vibes only you waking up and being like okay i'm gonna have a good day today i'm gonna get done everything i said i was gonna get done is the first step to having a good day the next one turn left milkshake right and we've been having a fit because the last couple of days they've been making it trash the last lady tasted like ice i don't know what she did but this guy did his one workout done quick and light day so yeah i'm about to continue on with my day i'll catch up with you guys later we said no time y'all i had to get some food and i went to this spanish place i'm about to show you guys what i got and take a couple bites Ooh, I hope I don't spill myself. Now, I'm like such a rice person. Like, I love rice. Like, I could eat just rice. Any rice. Chinese rice, hibachi, Spanish rice. Anything. Dang, I can't open it. Alright, so. This is what it's looking like. I got, um. Yellow rice. Um, white rice with beans on top. Because I wanted both rice and some chicken. How I like my food. I'm about to take a couple more bites and then head home because it's real busy over here so. so i am back home i just got out the shower and washed my hair now as you can see my hair like has some curls but it's really not that curly because i do straighten it like every two weeks and that is my preference i just like wearing my hair straight so i'm okay if some of my curl pattern you know loosens up a little bit but 
Oh, and my this eye is so red right now because every time I wash my hair, my eye just gets really irritated. So don't mind that. But I want to show you guys this deep conditioner that I use. It's called Hair Mayonnaise by Organics. This is what it looks like. Now you can find this at Walmart, probably on Amazon, but I always get it at Walmart and it's only like seven bucks. But yeah, helps treat and repair dry or damaged hair. Um, it has extra virgin olive oil, natural herbs, and egg protein. I've been using this for like a couple years and it's really good. So yeah, I'm gonna put this in my hair. First I'm gonna comb it out. All right, so I combed out my hair. I'm gonna open this and just put it all through my hair. Once I got the product all throughout my hair and I combed it through, I'm just putting my hair into a bun. And then you can use a shower cap, but something to lock in the moisture. All I had is a plastic bag. So I'm just putting that over my head. I'm going to actually put my bonnet on top just to keep that moisture in and let it sit for a minimum of 10 minutes. I let it sit for an hour and then rinse it out. Like May 20th, that weekend. This pimple on my head. Guys, I just finished my hair. Don't mind this pimple on my head, but it came out so cute. I'm like, feeling like a brand new. Is it the weekend if you don't have a lemon drop? This place I went to had blueberry lemon drops and it was so good. I was watching some sports they had playing on the TV and let's normalize going into the bar, getting two drinks and then being on our way 10 out of 10. Look at how hard it's raining outside. Oh my gosh. And then I don't have no umbrella, no nothing. So a box on my head and you gotta do what you gotta do when you just got your hair up, right? You know, so. Don't judge me. Boy, I know you want it. I can please you. I gotta read you. So I'm currently studying to get my insurance license. This is what I need to study in this packet as well. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. I already took the test and I failed a part of it. So now I'm like going in studying because i'm retaking it in a couple of days but it's okay we're gonna get it and my main thing was i'm not gonna beat myself up because i did not pass for one this is a hard test and i'm proud of myself for even passing the first part and now it's like i already know what's on the test so i know what i need to work on i know what i need to study and the same for you guys if you want to accomplish something and you don't get it the first second third try just keep trying, you gonna get it one day. Like, it reminds me of my license test, y'all. I failed my license twice. Can you believe it? The first time, I could not parallel park. Like, I could not parallel park at all. I was so underprepared. And I did it a few times, like when I was practicing, and I thought that was enough. But you know, when the person comes in the car, it's a whole different feeling. My second test, I parallel parked 
perfectly fine and the guy said that my turn was too sharp but that guy was rude too he made me nervous when he came in the car he didn't even say hi hello he was like put your seatbelt on and i was like but yeah the third time it was snowing and it was a younger lady and she was so sweet she came into the car like hi and she just made me feel so much more relaxed and at that point I felt like more prepared as well so yeah moral of the story is never give up even if it takes you a couple tries you're gonna get it so yeah this is what I'm doing for the rest of the night I'm studying for my test guys wish me luck wish me so much luck and this is gonna be the end of the video thank you guys so much for watching I hope that you enjoyed and I hope that you are having a blessed day and if nobody told you that they love you today just know that I love you and Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Stay tuned for more videos. I'm trying to be so consistent for you guys. Like, I'm trying. All right? I will see you guys later.